There were teachers that uh, that you uh, were afraid of or warned about, so to speak. Uh, uh, those teachers that were real stern and uh, you couldn't go in their classes playing. You had to be serious about what you were doing. Uh, but overall, uh, student and teachers had a good relationship. Uh, one of the things about the school was integration. And integration brought about a lot of change at, at Anderson since we were predominantly a black school. Uh, they brought white teachers in and uh, that was a new thing to us. And that was something that we had to uh, try to get used to. But uh, overall, the students and teachers had a good relationship, very good relationship. A lot of the people that uh, uh, they were in my neighborhood went to Anderson, and uh, of course we were a predominantly black school, so the area that I lived in on the east side was uh, uh, predominantly black, so we did. We, we, we loved our school. We loved Anderson, along with all the other schools in the community, uh, junior highs and elementary schools. But uh, it, was a, it was a source of pride for us. Yeah. The thing that really bothered me about the closing of the school, and it all had to do with integration. Um, of course, they bust us out, of course, and they, they didn't bust anybody in. And that was one of the drawbacks. I think integration kind of hurt us because rather than bringing us together, it divided, you know, divided us and it sent some of the kids out of the, to the other schools. And rather than you know, do something to make Anderson better or, you know, integrate Anderson, uh, they closed the school down. So I, I really didn't understand what the, really the particulars was and why they closed it down, but uh, um, I, I didn't really like that very much. I think that just kind of, I don't know.